Okay, so for the receiver, it's a BevRC modified with a Comtech module, Eagle Eyes from uh, Eagle Tree Systems with a power panel to take uh, advantage also of the GPS coordinates whether whenever I have the OSD Pro connected, an 8 inch display from uh, ready made RC, a DVR. Oops, probably they can stop recording from BevRC. I've also put in a one amp USB charger in a sort of cigarette lighter. There's some uh, panels here for uh, with, with uh, automatic fuses. I had a uh, smoke coming out of the system due to a short at one time. So nowadays I have the, the LCDs on one switch. I have the receiver and diversity on an, another one, the USB on a third one. And then for my diversity external helical, I have a, a current feed for that one also. I'm gonna install a SEPIC voltage regulator for the RX. So it always keeps it at 12 volts no matter what the battery is doing, which is currently at 12.3 volts. I use um, often uh, 12 volt, 12 amp hour, just a lead acid battery, sealed. Seems to be working fine and lasts a day at least. And running the tricopter of uh, Multiplex uh, RX 2.4 gigahertz with diversity seems to do what I want it to do. That's all for now. Oh yeah, and the tricopter itself, it's a um, RC Explorer 2.5 version, running of three cells. I use, I put um, a bit of um, veneer just to support the in-flight camera, because I seems to be always breaking the video out from my GoPro 2s, so I need to have a, a separate camera, feeding that off from the charge connector through a power filter from a DP cav having an RD pilot connected um, Afro 30 amps and uh, switching it over I have uh, um, a 400 milliwatt 1.32 gigahertz transmitter with a uh, Helical, oh, oh sorry, with a, um, a clover leaf from uh, Vätteri in Oulu, Finland. Works brilliantly. 